guys, um, I'm just going to take a breather a bit and, uh, you know, take a break from opening anything. Um, a lot of people have been requesting another look at the shrine, um, even though it's been uh, not too long since the last update. Um, but before that update, um, there was a big, big gap. Um, but yeah, it has changed, and I have rearranged it, in fact, so I thought I'd uh, might as well give you a quick update. Um, it now sort of displays my tins and everything a lot better, and... Uh, also the booster boxes, so yeah, and you can see that the Pokemon Center bag I got from uh, the Japanese seller um, earlier. That's my uh, <laughs> it's like a Pokemon Center shrine now. You can call it Pokemon Center if you want to know. Anyway, let's open it up and uh, take a look. All right, so before the Bleach haters and the the Pokey fan bo fanboys and fangirls hate me. Yes, there is bleach in here, but uh, what's the harm? It can be a pokey bleach shrine. There you go. Anyway, um, just run down. Um, these stuff uh, are still there, pretty much the games and stuff. Um, but the booster boxes have moved up to the top shelf. Um, so we have Secret Wonders, Great Encounters, and just Dawn there, and the three expedition Japanese. An expedition. Still waiting on Aqu Aquapolis and Sky Ridge, and another booster box actually. Um, but I'll. Um, all right, what the hell? I'll uh, just let you guys know now and give you a hint into what the next booster box is. Um, it's another Japanese one, but that's all I'm going to say. Not a huge hint, but that's what I'm going to say for now. Um, you'll find out soon enough. And the decks were taking up too much space in terms of it didn't need that much space, so I. Um, Economically, I suppose, gave it a nice little adequate space there and moved all my supply supplies up here. So it's like a sp supply shelf now. Um, and down here are the tins. Um, you guys will probably not have seen the tins just yet. Um, the, the Suicune, Entei and Raikou. Um, but let me just tell you, that was a nightmare in terms of trying to get those videos out there because I accidentally deleted them um, but I've recovered them and I've edited and everything and it should be up soon but the reason why I was so gutted was because um, those tins were possibly the best tins I've ever had um, and the pulls were absolutely phenomenal so that's all I'm going to say for now um, but I will upload that I um, hope you guys have been enjoying the Mysterious Treasures um, uh, and the and the tin and you know the whole Halloween birthday live special, um, but surprisingly I've got quite a few hate comments on there, which is um, a bit unnerving. But I'm not too I'm not too affected by it, but um, I'm just a bit surprised and overwhelmed by the fact that there's a few people out there who've decided to just suddenly, bam, hit us with their negativity for no apparent reason. But it's all good. I'm still doing it for you guys, and nothing will stop me. And I'll say so if I do. But that, that's apes away. But yeah, guys, um, that, that's the uh, Pokemon Center Shrine or whatever it is. Um, but yeah, it's looking pretty good. Um, you can call it Pokemon Center Shrine, whatever whatever it is. I don't know, I don't care. But um, it, it's Poke Collection Shrine anyway. Still, and will be always. Um, and the decks have gone to the other... You know, the other shelf, but that hasn't changed, so I won't bother showing you that. Um, right now, just to... Uh, just to quickly update you guys on other stuff that I'm doing, I'm also updating my folders. As you can see, all my folders are actually, but my binders actually, are all around here. I have to do a bit of a shift in terms of where the sets are. Um, but, you know, I'll get back to that um, shortly. But enjoy this for now, and um, tune into the tin openings. It'll be a YouTube's video, so you get to... Uh, choose which tins you want me to open first and uh, yeah I'll see you guys later <laughs> 